Welcome back to the channel. Symbiote Spider-Man Milestones have returned to Marvel Strike Force. So I wanted to check back in with you guys and let everyone know what does that mean? Has there been any change of the structure and what can we accomplish in this phase of the event? So the first thing I would like to share is that essentially no, it hasn't changed a lot. Um, when we look at the primary contributor to gaining shards, it is through spending gold in the high roller milestone. We still have uh, five shards available that cap out at the 1.825 million gold spin a day. So you need to try to do that. It's a primary contributor to be able to get as many shards as you can during the event. There are also milestones that will continue for the next 28 days. Um, at least that's the estimate that was in the in-game email for campaign energy as well which is essentially one a day because this resets every two days and there's only two shards available there and in world warrior there's a little less than one a day available because there are six shards available over seven days so when we do the full math that means that we have five a day from gold one a day from energy and a little less than one a day from battles now it's over 6.71 shards maximum each day through running the milestones um, there are a few offers that have popped in um, but that's a whole different thing if you're going to spend for that then spend if you're not then don't uh, given that the unlock for seeing about spider-man if this is your first run and their first opportunity to come to acquire him it will take a little under just just one day past two weeks <laughs> a little past halfway through this um, the max that we can get this round the first round we could get 199 because there were a few extra days we kind of they phased in a few of the milestones they didn't just all start them on the same day which is what we've done this time and which is what has happened in previous similar scenarios before this time they're all popping in at the same time let's go ahead and update this they're all starting on 415 There are exactly 28 days times the 6.71 for a few less shards. So 188 shards, we'll see. I mean, they may not end at all at the, at the same time. It may go a little bit longer, but it said 28 days in the in-game mail, so I'm going to stick with that. With 188 shards plus the 199, um, I am not going to get to 6-star. <laughs> so I'm going to be happy with 5-star and do it all for free. Um, yeah, so... I've gotten started on already. Uh, I had to wait a little bit. My real job uh, took over my evening tonight with conference calls into the Asia Pacific region. But yeah, I've gotten started already. Started spending. There were some interesting things available. I've been working on my Asgardians, and I'll really be able to push harder in there. Took them up to 50 with Hella and Heimdall, Sif. They're all at five star. So Black Bolt is happening. Sif is probably going to be able to get to where uh, she's available for six star and I am going to farm Hella as hard as I can. Hopefully get a six star Black Bolt. Um, past that I think I'm done with chasing metas for a while. I'm not going to be able to chase the Black Order meta and I don't think I even really want to. Uh, the, you know, the future of running mirror matches at the exact same speed with coin flips against five versus five of the exact same team uh, it doesn't seem fun to me, so I'm not going to chase that meta. I'll wait till that changes. Just accept a different place in Arena. And I really want to take the last part of this video to say thank you. I have had hundreds of people subscribe to my channel uh, over the last couple of weeks. Um, I'm here just to share this analysis with everyone for the game that I really still enjoy, even sometimes when it's a little frustrating. It's actually, it's a lot more than a little frustrating sometimes. Uh, but yeah, I really do appreciate it. I want to make content that's interesting to you. If you have thoughts of things that you'd like me to look into, please put it in the comments. Feel free to like and subscribe any of the videos that you do like. If you don't, don't like them if you don't. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'm happy to share with you my goals. If I can get to a thousand subscribers and lots of views, then uh, all I really want to do is to be able to uh, upgrade some simple things and engage 
this community more and build the content that you want. So better internet service so that I can run effective Twitch streams or uh, better streams here on YouTube. Uh, if when I need to update my hardware, that's all it'll be used for. Not an extravagant lifestyle, not any crazy uh, extravagant uh, gambling spins in the game. Just really what it would take to help make it a better experience for you and to enjoy this hobby that we all have to share together. Have a great day. Stay safe. Stay healthy.